Hey guys, I'm Ram here and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to show you a bit of footage of when I was down in Saskatchewan hunting peri dogs with a .22 uh, long rifle. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Uh, if you're not interested in passing videos, don't watch this. And if you might be offended, don't watch this video. It is a hunting video, so please don't watch if you're offended. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. The quality won't be as good since I'm using my cell phone, but uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it anyway. So take care and bye-bye. All right, guys, so here's a bit of a background just to know what was going on today, that day. Um, I was out in the field front with a farmer and uh, he would give me permission to hunt there and I'd gone on with him because this was an exchange so I was able to go and hunt prairie dogs in Saskatchewan. So as you see I'm walking around, it's quite windy, um, I'll put on the volume after but um, it was quite a windy day, there's a lot of wind going, uh, blowing uh, on the uh, microphone of the camera. Uh, we're out in the field in, the, um, in this pasture and uh, there's no animals in it right now currently. So we were able to look around for prairie dogs. I mean, they are making holes and um, destroying crops, so they had to be uh, taken down. So I'm walking around here. As you see, looking, we're scouting around for prairie dogs. There's two, two of us with guns, about five of us. We're all searching for um, some prairie dogs. I'm the only one wearing face paint and camo, <laughs> ironically, but I thought it'd be kind of cool to have. Um, it might be a bit blurry, the footage, for some reason, but yeah, as you see, I'm walking back, and we're currently, we just got there, and we're going to look for some prairie dogs. So this is a clip from one of the first hunts, uh, shots of the day. I've missed twice now since it's very close and I'm not used to this gun. Um, the person on my left gets it first shot through the lungs and I go for the follow-up shot, shot in the hole twice and that was pretty fun to get. So one tip I like to use when I'm hunting with two people or another person is to do a countdown wherever I see an animal and uh, basically what it does is I count down and we both shoot at the same time. So that day we, we decided to uh, I decided to do a couple of countdowns so you see a couple examples. I'll just count down and we both shoot at the same time and that usually boosts the chance of getting the animal. Alright so here's the last clip of the hunt of that day. Uh, it's just me shooting down, uh, shooting at a prey dog while I'm lying down. Um, and I've got I got about three prairie dogs that day, and the other person got two prairie dogs. So it, was, it wasn't too bad for uh, like two hours of a like two-hour hunt. So yeah, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know the quality is not that good, and um, here's some. I'm gonna put a couple pictures at the end of the of me. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, even though it was short and uh, kind of just thrown together. I didn't have any, or it wasn't very organized. I just had a couple phone phone clips I wanted to show. Still was kind of fun to do. Um, I'll have new videos coming out pretty soon uh, later this week. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care and bye-bye.